Netcasts you love. From people you trust. This is Twit. So I have three speakers, and they're all from the same company, 808 Audio. Um, and they're all Bluetooth speakers. You can see uh, we have the 808 uh, Hex SL, the 808 Hex TL, and the 808 Hex XL. Wow, you got to keep S, that straight. S, T, and X is how it works. Um, all of them are Bluetooth. Uh, now, I'm just going to cover a f uh, a, the features that all of them have. They all have aux inputs. So on the back of each of them, they have a, a place that you can plug in a headphone. Uh, and so if you happen to have a device that isn't Bluetooth ready, don't worry. This will support it. Um, they're all covered by a one-year warranty and... Um, they all have, uh, I guess I was going to say a charging cable, but this one right here does not uh, have a micro USB. This is the only one that doesn't have a rechargeable battery in included. You have to, uh, if you're going to use batteries with uh, the TL, you need to use eight AAA batteries. Is the TL kind of considered the middle of the line? Yes, But absolutely. it doesn't have the rechargeable battery. It doesn't have the rechargeable oh, battery. Um, so let's. Let, I'll go ahead and start with the SL. The SL is the smallest of them by <laughs> obvious uh, mm -hmm. uh, looks. Uh, it has a few functions. It has a volume up, down, uh, a sync button, and then at the bottom there is a power toggle. This is just a switch. So when you shut this down, you just flip the switch, and you can see the LED light on the top. It'll just, uh, or at the bottom actually, it'll just shut off. Uh, this is made with aluminum. In fact, this is my favorite out of all of the build qualities. It it's, looks really light. It's it, well, it's uh, you know, it's heavy enough. I would say okay. it's not. Well, it's not, yeah, uh, right. You don't want something like right. this because it's super portable. You don't want it to right. be super light and fragile. Right. You're gonna throw this in your backpack. Exactly. It's gonna crumple. And also the 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 weight. Uh, there is a, a a pretty substantial battery in here. This is last. Uh, they claim up to 12 hours. And I, I didn't play it continuously for 12 hours, mm -hmm. but it definitely lasted a few days uh, with, with you know, about a week, actually, with me not charging it and playing it while I was doing laundry and, and things like that. This was by far my favorite form factor out of all of the speakers as well. This can easily fit into the back of my pocket. It doesn't. It might not seem like it, it can, but it fits in a back pocket quite easily. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, e this is what I normally did with it is I did laundry, threw this in my back pocket, and then I'd have audio throughout the house no matter where I walked. Uh, and I know that sounds a little bit absurd, but it was the most enjoyable thing uh, ever. Um, on top of that, uh, because of its size, you could I could put it if you know I didn't want it in my back pocket anymore. You, I could just set it next to the sink if I was doing dishes or chores around the house. Um, and it also is is the correct size to put into a cup holder if you want to throw it in your car. Um, some things it doesn't have is it doesn't have play, pause, uh, skip to next and back features. Uh, you have to do that on your phone uh, for a quick audio snippet. Uh, obviously, it's going to be the quietest out of the three because it's just the smallest. It only has a single speaker uh, in there. Um, but here, this is actually, in fact, your own album. Oh, I think I know this guy, yeah. yeah. Kind of you know, a little weird hearing hearing my song hearing him. on Before You Buy. Actually. Yeah. I'm not going not gonna to lie. But I would say that that's a pretty substantial Loud. amount of yeah. audio out of out of something that's less than half a foot tall. Yeah, no kidding. Um, let me nice. make sure there aren't anything else uh, that I'm forgetting. And uh, the, the wireless range of Bluetooth for all of these is around 30 feet. There, there was times that I kind of forgot that I had set my phone in my bedroom, and it wasn't until I was like in the kitchen, which is a hallway, a living room, and a hall, and like a second hallway away from my uh, my bedroom. Uh, that I realized that it started to break up because I was so far away. And there's also like an air conditioning in the middle of that. On the pros, I, on this device, I really like that it was metal. Its construction was by far my favorite and uh, it's super duper portable. Uh, for the cons, no play, pause, and skip buttons. And what is the price on that one again? This is $70. Okay. Or sorry, $60. $59.99 okay. coming in at $60. Nice. I think that that is a very good price point for, for that one. Next, Next is the TL. The TL uh, has um, the uh, not only um, uh, it has two speakers basically um, instead of actually it has three. It has two on the front and one uh, base on the back. Now this is oh. plastic construction, unlike the aluminum that was the SL. On top of that, it doesn't use a micro 
uh, USB to charge. It uses an actual AC cord, so if you lose this, you cannot charge it. In fact, you have to use the AA batteries unless if you want to run to Radio Shack and pick up a, right. another uh, charger. Um, the sound quality on this, let me go ahead and switch over. All of these uh, will make this sort of audible sound whenever they are connected, so you'll hear that uh, coming up here Waiting in just for. a second, and it'll be boo -doo 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 boop there we go. Oh. And the other one, the SL, actually made a sound that it had disconnected. It was a okay. very uh, Oh, is that the, like the ring? Okay. Yeah, exactly. Um, uh, this uh, has the power button uh, and audio buttons on the top, as well as the sync button. No play pause on this. Let's go ahead and just give you a quick glimpse of how loud it is. And this is... Uh, let's turn this all the way up. Blast it. There we go. Bonk. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now this a was little a little clearer, a little more clarity on this definitely. one, definitely, and it's more directional. Yeah, because the speakers on the front and on the back. Um, I gotta say, uh, I'm jumping a little bit ahead, but out of the TL and the XL, I like this one's form factor that it was tall instead of wide because this fits a lot better on a sure. nightstand than this. Uh, so I want to point that out. So pros and cons on the TL is that uh, I liked its taller form factor. Um, I did not like the fact that it was made out of plastic and that it didn't have a micro USB charger. It had the, uh, the DC in charger. Excellent. Moving on to the XL. This is, oh, and this uh, one's cost. The TL's cost is $80. So okay. we went from 60 to 80. $20 bump for a little bit more clarity. Yeah, and you can guess the, guess the, the, the um, pattern. 2000 This is 2000 oh, No, exactly. No, really bad at this $100 for the XL. So this is the highest end one. This one does have a rechargeable battery inside of it, uh, and it has a micro USB uh, to charge. Uh, nice thing about this is it has a handle, and then on the side you're also given your skip to next track, back, uh, last track, play pause, and then here over on the other side is your volume up, down, pair, and power buttons. And those are all controlling whatever Bluetooth device you happen to have connected to exactly. at that point. That's exactly, nice. iOS okay. or Android for mm -hmm. all of these. Uh, and then at the bottom is your little subwoofer here uh, that's kind of hidden so that it'll hit the table. Um, let's just go ahead and, and pair uh, this one up. Uh, is this, this is a plastic as well? It's or? also plastic, okay, but it's like, it feels a, like a rubberized. Exactly, it's like a matte plastic. plastic. Yeah. Uh, I gotta say the feel is really nice on that, but I really kind of miss the. I mean, it might be metal. It just—it's yeah. almost hard to tell because it is on that one because of the of the matteness of the finish. Mm -hmm. um, so I uh, this one's the back is definitely you know you know I don't know it's actually quite difficult to tell uh, what this one is uh, constructed out of. Um, in terms of uh, usability, uh, this one I, I left in my kitchen most often because mm -hmm. that was where I had the counter space. Um, and uh, this one I left in, on the nightstand uh, for, uh, for use there. So you can hear a ding, ding, ding. Release. That was this one releasing. And then this one should connect up. Hopefully it did. It may have gone to sleep on us because it wasn't connected before. It was there like, dude, you aren't using me. There we go. Oh, okay. And that, uh, that was it turning on, and now it's paired. So it makes two sounds when you turn it on. Let's switch back over to... I like the name. I like that they chose 808. Obviously, they're, they're, you know, it's, it's a play on 808, which is kind of an old-school uh, drum machine that you hear on all types of music since the 80s. So Perfect. I think it's a, kind of a cool choice that they had. And all of them have a really nice design language. They all have this hex uh, sort of grid on the front, and uh -huh. I really kind of like that uh, throughout all the products. So... Let's go ahead and hit play. Definitely okay. the loudest. Yeah, a little harsher though. Like it is. And I don't know if that's because it's facing out more. I'm not really quite sure why that is, but kind of hurts a little bit. Like, and this is all the way up. Could yeah. also be the song. You know? uh, no, well, what's funny <laughs> is I'm really. You've you were you've mixed or you were part of the mixing process. I've for heard this these song. songs far too many you've times. You've heard this song so <laughs> many times. You can tell instantly yeah, yeah. How, where it's harsh, if it's right. harsh on the top or the bottom. Um, so uh, so this one uh, comes in at a hundred dollars. Um, 
On the pros, it was the only one that had the play, pause, back, forward buttons. Um, on the cons, uh, I didn't really love how wide this was, just sure. the, the form factor of it. Oh, on the pros, it also had, it's the one with the handle, which is kind of cool. So, uh, buy, try, don't buy. Let's just go down the line. For the SL, this is definitely a buy. In fact, uh, if, if uh, when we send this back, um, I'm probably going to go buy this for myself because nice. I enjoyed it. So it, just walking around the house without headphones on, being able to hear um, f phones ringing or cats screaming or I don't know. Uh, it was just really <laughs> nice. I cats freaking... might be screaming because you're playing your music super loud. <laughs> May, on perhaps. Just and I'm jamming out to music because I'm fitting yeah. that. Um, on the TL, uh, this one's going to be... Uh, I'm going to give this one a try uh, just because it doesn't have the rechargeable batteries. Uh, which was a little bit of a uh, bummer. Uh, and then on the XL, I'm also going to give this one a try. It just didn't seem like it was worth the basic doubling of price uh, for the extra play, right. pause, and sync features. And I wasn't th super thrilled with the footprint of it. Um, but I did like that they added back in a rechargeable battery and those extra features. So this is a try. So buy, try, try for the... 808 Hex series of Bluetooth speakers. Oh, and they also co all come, I know it's not really that High much. quality they come in plastic some container. Freaking crazy ass packaging. <laughs> I mean, this is super high, like, you, this is like, you could put it on a desk yeah, and it would be a jewel. Make your new safe deposit box at home. It's fireproof. <laughs> basically, yeah, yeah, basically. Basically. So all of them come in, in very fancy packaging, which you're probably paying for in the MSRP. Yeah, at least a little bit. <laughs> at, at least, least a couple of dollars. Chad Johnson, thank you. Thank you so much for uh, showing off the speakers. No and, problem. And, uh, you know, playing my music just one too many times. Next time, a little dance music. Part. Okay, absolutely. Yeah, we'll go for EDM next time. Because like you said. And Yellow Gold. I've, oh, great. Ever won. Uh, go all get right, it. switch it, away. Switch yellow away. Gold no Music. Need. Thank you so much for that, Brian.